Hello, I am the Jonathan 2000, a highly trained robot. I mean, grad student. This is how you work up a reaction. Add some of the organic solvent, in this case I'm adding ethyl acetate. Pour into a separatory funnel. Rinse the flask a couple of times, or until the liquid has no color. Then add some more organic solvent to the funnel, to dilute the reaction mixture. I then add about 50 milliliters of saturated sodium chloride, also known as brine. Secure the stopper, and shake the funnel, being sure to hold the stopper, so it doesn't fall out. Vent early and often, by opening the stopcock, as pressure may build up quickly. Shake and vent a few times, then place the funnel back on the ring stand, and allow the layers to separate. Slowly open the stopcock, and drain the aqueous layer. In this case the aqueous layer is on the bottom, but depending on the organic solvent, it may be on the top. Check the density of your solvent to be sure. In a clean early in my earth flask, drain the organic solvent. I have a pretty hairy arm for a robot. Pour the aqueous layer back into the separatory funnel. Add fresh organic solvent, and extract two more times. Add magnesium sulfate to the combined organic fractions to remove any remaining water. Continue to add it until the mag sulfate no longer clumps, and it appears fluffy. Filter the mixture to remove the mag sulfate. Instead of using vacuum, I like to push with the palm of my hand. It's just as fast. C3PO taught me that trick. The resulting solution should contain no solid material. To make sure I get everything, I like to rinse the flask and filter with organic solvent. Now throw it on the roto map, and you're all set. Number 5 alive.